Hello, I'm Anna, your automated natural navigation assistant. I can help you explore Mexico and find fun things to do. I've been upgraded with the new Forza Link module. Forza Link tracks the status of you and the people you meet online and suggests ways for you to link up and play together. Every time you see this light up, it's suggesting a new way for you to link up with other drivers. Hey lady, that's it. It's time for an adventure. Here's the thing, it's not all about expansion. We also want to build our existing outposts with bigger race programs and more events. Expeditions into the unknown or new adventures in our own backyard. I'll tell her you're available. Honestly, she won't say it, but I know this is important to her. You're not gonna believe this, but you've earned a gift drop from another driver. Makes you feel all warm and fuzzy inside, doesn't it? <laughs> and meet me down there and we'll have a look. You have arrived at your destination. Hey! Ellie, how can I help? Jump in the buggy. I'll tell you the story on the way. Ramiro was looking through old things at his father's home last week, and he found this photo. He gave it to me, said I might enjoy it, but I don't think he realized what he was. My friend, what would you say are the two most important things in Mexican culture? Uh, family and food? Family and art? Family and music? <laughs> Close. Familia and the Volkswagen Beetle. Bocho is the Mexican nickname. My bisabuelo Fernando was the first Torres to own one. And thanks to that photo, I think I know where it is. Seriously? Let's go find it. Tell me about him. Bisabuelo means great-grandfather, but in the family, he's just Papa Fernando. We never met, but everyone says I'm exactly like him. <laughs> Loca por autos. You have to understand, in Mexico, a bocho is like the family member that lives in your garage. Papa Fernando loved that car to death, and I think Muerte finally came for it on a muddy road near here. He took one last photo and left it there. So, that's where we're going. If you can find it, I can get it running again. I really hope we can save it. Let's get up into the hills. Look for a turnoff. There should be a road or, or a track. Aquí! Just like in la photo. Look around. This is definitely the place, but no sé, why would Papa Fernando bring the bocho up here? The storms can get tremendas. Let me just get the door. Is that key? <laughs> it's really here. <laughs> we found it for you, Papa Fernando. But look at it. I've never seen a beetle like that. Oh, the weather's closing in. I don't like the look of the roads around here. You drive the truck. Got it. I'll have to put in a new batteria, plenty of oil, llantas, lo eléctrico. Oh, this is gonna be hard, even for me. <laughs> it's a beetle. I bet it starts first go. <laughs> You know, I wouldn't be surprised. If 
an eye open for road work. The roads look open just now. Maybe we'll be lucky. <laughs> Maybe not so lucky after all. Ah, looks like road work. Can you find a way past it? Hmm. I think I can manage that. <laughs> That's one way through. What are you gonna do then? I have muchas ideas. That's the thing about a bocho. It's not just a car. It's a lifestyle. Park the truck here. I'll take care of the rest. What did I tell you? Finding lost cars isn't magic. It takes good luck, hard work, and sometimes a drone. <laughs> Ooh, my friend. The hard work is just getting started. Call you soon. Mi amigo. I've been working on the bocho and learning more about Papa Fernando. Come meet me when you have time. I'll show you what I mean. <laughs> 